three years on from the referendum result where the people of the UK voted to leave the EU, here I still stand in the European Parliament in Brussels. Yes, I'm packing to leave and moving my stuff out of my office at the moment because it's the end of the parliamentary term. But the UK is still a member. In fact, just down the road from here, Theresa May is arriving very soon on bended knee, begging for an extension to the time. We've had three years and here she is begging for more time because her leadership has failed, because she's absolutely failed to get the one thing that she was elected to do, the one thing that she said, Brexit means Brexit, whatever that means. She promised us that she would get an orderly departure from the EU and she has failed. The establishment have bamboozled many people, including our so-called Prime Minister, if she ever wanted to leave really in the first place. The situation we have now is pure chaos. For the first time in my life, when I meet people from other countries, they're actually pitying me for being British because they look at the chaos that's going on in our country. They're laughing at us. This must end, this must stop. No half measures, we voted to leave, that has not been enacted, that must be enacted. The people's will must be heard. And if we are forced to go into European elections three years later, I can assure you whether or not it be me or whether it be others, the force that will come here, led by Nigel Farage, will be so effective, so powerful and link up with so many people across this parliament that they will sincerely regret not allowing us to, to leave. So, everyone watching this, keep your head up. We're still trying our best. If we don't get out before these elections, please have a look and think carefully about who you vote for because this is a crucial time. But right now, all I can say is we're in an awful spot, but we've been in worse. So let's stay strong, stay composed. Remember we're British and don't ever, ever surrender. We'll get there. And if we don't get there, there will have been a coup against the British people of a level never seen before. And when that happens, our system, our democracy is worth nothing. It's time for a change. It's time for the people to stand up once more. And it's time for us to be independent, a friend of European countries, but not within the EU. This is our time and our moment. We will not surrender.